I remember it was really late when I arrived. Okay. And um, so I saw him on the other side of the road. All right. I, I can almost see it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm walking towards him and he starts saying that uh, the hotel rooms have not... Um, it's, it's like people haven't left, so like there's just a lot of people, and we had to share one room together. Okay. So oh. yeah. <laughs> like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, oh, thank goodness I'm in my jeans, so that's yes. just how we're going to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> so when I got there, and then I asked him, um, you say that I'm going to be paid upon arrival, mm. but then he said that these people are not uh, picking calls, so I kind of have to wait. Mm -hmm. But in the middle of the night, as you know, we are trying to now get to know each other he was constantly picking calls and it was calls that i think he had paid some people to pretend that they're giving him mm -hmm. deals and more deals so he'll pretend oh there's uh, a deal for always so yeah the lady at amefika uh to me a payment ningapi uh -huh. so like i'm already mm -hmm. getting excited because i'm like so yes. more deals are coming in yes. as i am waiting i've not even performed this <laughs> event that i'm supposed to be hosting but another deal is already it's coming, also coming in. in yeah and he's like oh oh so we're going to get the lady for the makeup she'll be coming tomorrow all oh, right 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 okay so it was a really you know detailed conversation about how the deal is going to come through yeah so i'm already feeling positive in mm -hmm. my gut i'm already mm -hmm. telling my mom how exactly I am and they're my biggest supporters yeah. so it was even my mom who sent me the money to go to Eldoret at the time oh. because I'm 19 wow. like right. usually fresh out of high school yeah. so and then I, I get employed so a lot is just happening yes. all at the same time yeah so when we stayed at the hotel room that the first night he had actually paid for it mm -hmm. but for the next day I had to do that and it's money I didn't even have because I remember I had to take a loan so that I can pay for the hotel room because he kept saying that hey I'm in a really bad state. And then, then he had a brother-in-law, a fake brother-in-law, <laughs> who apparently was in prison and it was a oh. drug case. So yeah. that is why his accounts were frozen. Oh. So he couldn't access any money. So this whole time, um, you know, I'm a nice person, just like Rose, I would it's say. It's okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm okay. Don't you worry. I got this. Yeah. So I found myself helping him and, you know, coming through for him. The and you've not time even been given there. a down payment for the job that yeah. you're supposed to and do. And then I, I don't know if he had checked the weather, you know, forecast or whatever, because yeah. it started raining on the day of the event on Madaraka Day. So yeah. that is how the event got cancelled. So yeah. I'm, I'm like, oh, oh, that's unfortunate. So yeah. they're not going to pay me. Then he's like, no, they will. But, you know, we have to wait. But meanwhile, uh, there's this other deal and we need to, like, you know, get going Chase on it. it and see if we can, you know, get it as we wait for these other people to pay you. So it was crazy because that was just not the only deal he uh, talked about, the always one. The next day, Christabel, now the fake sister, tells me <laughs> that uh, to my partner in Guinea, a singleton. So me and you, we are going to be brand ambassadors, something of the sort, and we're supposed to travel. Was it Italy? Something of the sort. And then now, you know, we are getting into all that excitement. This guy even took me round Eldoret looking for outfits that I would wear, like, and I then, did that, like literally even trying to purchase some outfits, knowing that, you know, these things are coming through for me. And then that day, he said that I needed to pay the down payment for the makeup lady. I even talked to her. I, I okay. don't know where she was even coming from. So who's paying you or him? Me. You were paying for yeah, the down payment. His, his account is frozen. So. Oh, the brother. <laughs> the brother. And the money is coming back somehow <laughs> after the deals, you know. So it was just a roller coaster of all these things. Yeah. But I think one thing I came to learn now, because you've mentioned, you know, mm -hmm. all these things kind of just teach you lessons. Mm -hmm. I think the biggest thing that this uh, guy used against me was greed. Because, mm -hmm. you know, when you're greedy... When you get into that situation, you're like, oh, oh, the money upon arrival, I'm going to get it. Mm. Then I remember um, during uh, that time when I was still traveling, they sent me another email saying that, oh, they've asked if you can host the after party for 30000 So you're just getting all these things All the coming, things are coming in. And they're not even <clears throat> stopping. So I'm excited. I'm talking to my mom. My friends are happy for me. You know, I talked to people. <laughs> but this time, they were very happy for me. They're like, oh, my God. Like, go for we're it, so, girl. We're so happy. <laughs> That all this is happening. Can yeah. we just take a break to, to just digest, <laughs> digest. all this? Because it's a lot. It's a lot. And then when we come back, I think Bishop <laughs> will just want to understand do this do they have a face? Like do they have like characteristics that maybe we should yeah. 
mm -hmm. probably know about because they seem so calculative. Yeah. They actually yeah. know what they're supposed to do and it's just too much, all right? So we'll yeah. also be looking at that in a moment.